The agreement that both sides reached today was not reached lightly. A stunning turn of events as Texas Attorney General Ken Paxton and the prosecutors trying him for securities fraud reach an agreement to avoid a trial nine years after Paxton was first charged. And that comes just three weeks before the trial was supposed to start. Prosecutors were on the defensive today answering the question, what's changed? The intensive investigation and reinvestigation of the facts of these cases was the ultimate game changer. Why didn't that happen at some point earlier in the nine years? You know what? Um, I'm not going to comment on that. Under the terms of the agreement, Paxton must pay nearly $275,000 in restitution, complete 100 hours of community service, and enroll in 15 hours of a legal ethics course. If he completes those three things, prosecutors agreed to drop the charges against him. In a statement, Paxton praised the decision, saying he'll provide further comment in the weeks ahead. Now, Paxton could have both this trial and the historic impeachment trial behind him. He comes out of this, I think, you know, not too far from where he started uh, in terms, particularly in terms of how of how Republicans view him. One unknown remains the state of a federal investigation into Paxton. Is um, it still active? I, I don't know. They don't call me. They don't text me. They don't send me Christmas cards. Now, nine years after he was originally charged, the Texas attorney general walks away with another personal legal win. Thank you for watching. Please hit the subscribe button and get the latest news by downloading the CBS Austin News app.